Hello, this is Natasha Cooper, your Power English Coach. Welcome to Power English Minute. St. Patrick's Day is coming up. Every year on March 17th, Irish Americans celebrate their heritage and culture. St. Patrick's Day is not an official holiday in America, but it's a fun day for many, Irish or not. There'll be numerous parades around the states, the biggest ones in New York and Boston. Policemen will march along with bagpipe bands and traditional Irish kilts and Irish dances. The restaurants will serve corned beef and cabbage, lamb stew and Irish coffee. School kids will decorate the classrooms with shamrocks and leprechauns. Adults over 21 may use St. Patrick's Day as a good excuse to go to a local bar and have a drink. If March 17th lands on a weekend, students, I guarantee you, will have a loud party. You may often hear a conversation that goes like this. What are you doing on St. Patrick's Day? My girlfriends and I are going to Murphy's Pop to sing karaoke. How are you getting there? Do you need a ride back home? I hope you have a designated driver. Can you drive us there? We'll get a cab or Uber home. What are you doing on St. Patrick's Day? My girlfriends and I are going to Murphy's Pub to sing karaoke. How are you getting there? Do you need a ride back home? I hope you have a designated driver. Can you drive us there? We'll get a cab or Uber home. What's Uber? It's a new kind of ride service where regular people with their own cars sign up to drive. They run a background check on them, then you download an app. When you request a ride, they let you pick how big the car you want and send you a picture of what the, the driver looks like. They pick you up and it's all paid through the app on your phone with a credit or debit card. So, on March 17th, no matter what day of the week it lands on, wear something green and drive safely. For more scripts for daily life, work and travel, check out Power English System, what to say and how to say it. This is Natasha Cooper, your Power English Coach.